Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to take a look at this very special Timex Snoopy watch. It is a collaboration between Timex and Peanuts, you know the Peanuts comic or the cartoon. So before we move into the watch, let's take a look at the box because I find that the box is quite nice. When I received the watch, it came in an open case. I bought this piece online and uh, it was uh, sent through mail to me and uh, of course it's uh, bubble wrap and everything but the watch is kind of like you know sitting in an exposed position so i guess when i open up the uh, the packages i straight away can see the watch sitting in this very nice box it's a uh, word timex and peanuts okay so at the back we have a very interesting cartoon here there's a snoopy on the on its uh, dog house and there's a bird staying he 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 and Timex versus, uh, I mean, or Timex, uh, I don't know. It's with peanuts, multiply peanuts, I don't know. And yes, the model number of this piece, it's uh, TW2R41400. If you're interested to get one, you can still find this online. So let's change the perspective and move in a little bit closer to the watch. All right, we're back to our usual perspective. Let's get straight into the dimension of the watch. The watch has a case diameter of 38 millimeters. It has a thickness of 8.8 .8 millimeters. The lug to lug distance is about 45.4 millimeters, maybe 45.5. And it has a lug width of 20 millimeters. The case of this piece is entirely highly polished. But one thing that you might need to take note is that uh, on Timex website, it is stated that the case is made from base metal. So I'm guessing it's kind of like a brass and uh, it's chrome plated. So it's not stainless steel. Okay, but for the price that of this piece, I think there's nothing much that we can complain about. Uh, the luck has a very thin profile and everything has uh, a rounded uh, edges. It's, uh, there's no sharp corners on this piece. Everything is very smooth and rounded. Uh, there is a crown, but it's not signed. And the crown, besides uh, uh, letting us adjust the time, it also has a cool function. Of course, that is uh, well known on all Timex watches. Maybe I will show that later. So let's get to the, straight to the dial on the watch. The dial itself has a Snoopy holding a baseball and a baseball bat. Okay, there is no second hand. And the hour hand is the shorter hand that it is holding the ball. And the minute hand is the other hand that is holding the baseball bat. Let me just uh, try to move the hands around so that you can have a better, better look. Okay. So as you can see, when the time moves on this uh, piece, the hand on <laughs> Snoopy will swing around. Okay. Let's move it to the typical 10-10 position. Okay, this is how the watch look with the hands at 10-10 position. Okay, it looks very nice. And uh, on the dial itself, the Snoopy is printed. Okay, and then the hands have uh, printed, uh, you know, color printing on the ball and the baseball bat. The indices on this piece are all printed and there is uh, minute trackers all around the dial. The dial is of a white color and I think the red Snoopy hat complements the red uh, enclosed uh, maybe one piece NATO strap or uh, maybe it's a Zulu strap. Okay. There's no date and there's no second hand. Okay, so uh, one cool thing about all these uh, Timexes is that uh, they have in the glow function. So when we press down on the crown, you can see that the entire dial will just glow. Okay, maybe I'm not showing it at the best lighting, but yep, you can see. Right, that's a very cool feature on uh, Timex timepieces. The strap is quite okay. I mean, uh, it's quite thick and it's not very rough. So when you put it on the wrist, it won't like, you know, uh, irritate your wrist like some other cheap uh, uh, NATO straps out there. But the buckle is not signed. Okay, let's pull this out and take a look at the 
case back. So this is the case back of the watch. Okay, it's Timex 2017 peanuts, and it's using a CR2016 cell. It has a water resistance of 30 meters, and the case back is stainless steel. So that's pretty much. Uh, it about this piece everything is quite simple and since it's a quad I'm not gonna talk about you know the accuracy and all that yep so all in all this to me it's a very fun and you know very nice piece let's uh, do a wrist shot okay this is how the watch looks on my six inch wrist uh, the small size actually makes it wear very nicely and the length of the Included Zulu strap. It's uh, not very long. So even on my small 6 inch wrist, uh, there is not much balance left. So I will just like, you know, fold it this side and tuck it in. So if you have a bigger wrist, then you might uh, have some problem with uh, the strap. Maybe you will need to, you know, uh, change to a longer strap. But I, I guess this is uh, a watch maybe for kids and maybe for... <laughs> The ladies but to me it's it's kind of okay because i have a small wrist and it's really a fun piece and uh, if i'm not mistaken this is part of timex weekender series that is why the part number is tw so it's meant to be a weekend watch so let's say if you're a serious you know wrist uh, wrist watch guy and you know you have to wear like off formal office wear during the, the during the weekdays so I guess weekend it's a fun time for you to you know rest kick back and relax and you know just put on a very nice cartoony piece all right that's it for this video and if you're new to my channel please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and please don't forget to follow me on my instagram at gfw underscore watch and i will catch you catch you guys in the next video bye bye